40 miles per hour. Chance of precipitation near 100%. Wednesday night, snow showers. Additional light snow accumulation. Winding is much colder with lows around to above. Northwest winds 20 to 30 miles per hour with gusts up to 40 miles per hour. Chance of snow near 100%. Wind chill values as low as 14 below. Yep. Thursday, partly sunny. Much colder with highs around 17. Northwest winds 15 to 20 miles per hour. Wind chill values as low as 17 below. Thursday night, mostly cloudy. Not as cold with lows around 10 above. Wind chill values as low as zero. At 3 p.m., weather reports for selected cities. At Cleveland Hopkins Airport, it was cloudy. The temperature was 61 degrees, the dew point 41, and the relative humidity 47%. The wind was wow, west six to at 10 inches. An hour. The pressure was 29.67 inches and falling. Wow, that's a, that's a lot of snow for this time of year. Here we go.
in Ohio, Ashtabula Inland, Ashtabula Lakeshore, Cuyahoga, Geauga Lake and Lorraine. Winter storm warning in effect on 6 a.m. Wednesday to 2 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time Thursday. The National Weather Service in Cleveland has issued a winter storm warning for snow, blowing snow, sleet and freezing rain, which is in effect from 6 a.m. Wednesday to 2 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time Thursday. The winter storm watch is no longer in effect. Accumulations, snow accumulation of 6 to 10 inches, along with a glaze of ice. Timing, rain will develop overnight and then change to snow Wednesday morning. As the rain transitions to snow, there could be a period of freezing rain. The heaviest snow should occur from late morning into late afternoon. The snow will slowly taper off through the evening. Winds north 20 to 30 miles per hour with gusts up to 50 miles per hour. Impacts, snow along with a glaze of ice will slow travel across the region and make any untreated surfaces slick. In addition, strong winds will cause blowing and drifting. A winter storm warning is issued when severe winter weather is expected. Heavy snow and flash or ice will cause hazardous driving conditions. If you will be traveling in the warning area, you should choose an alternate route if possible, or you should use extreme caution if travel is unavoidable. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio for further details and updates. Should be it. At 3 p.m., weather reports for select.